So with that, I think it'd be best just to show you what we've done and what's inside this box that says Cisco on it. So let's do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to share with you a new product that, we releasing, that we're releasing that I call do-it-yourself telepresence. It's for every room. Now, I want to give a, start with a stat. 93% of the conference rooms in the world don't have video. How many of you have incredible quality video at home? Okay, a few of the Cisco execs, put your hands down, and the rest, thank you. That's my point. The stuff needs to be affordable, first of all. It needs to be easy to buy, to configure, to set up, and to use. It needs to have an incredible experience, a delightful experience. You won't have to want to use this stuff. And those are some of the key elements that we put into this box. And it's called do-it-yourself telepresence. We wanted a product that we could put into every single conference room. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to demo that for you. And this is an actual shipping product. We just released it. Um, it's less expensive than this beautiful Samsung TV that we have here. This is a Samsung 65-inch TV. We just bought it from Best Buy last night. We brought it here. And I actually wanted to myself take the product out of the box, as any of you would as a partner setting it up for a customer or maybe yourself doing it at home. So let's just go ahead and do it. We're going to make a call, and we're going to do the whole thing. So what's in the box? We've got a bunch of get some cables here. The first thing you're going to see is this unit right here. This is officially the SX10. I call it DIY telepresence. Uh, and so you're going to see this is it. It's one of my team calls it adorable. It's really nice. It's small. This is the entire thing right here. It's got a pan tilt, pan -tilt zoom camera. And there's absolutely no compromise on performance. And that was the key thing is that there's been no lack of why is, why is there only video in 7% in, in of the rooms in the world? There's been no lack of systems that were inexpensive. They just aren't very high quality. What we wanted was incredible quality at a great price. That's what this product is. And I'm going to show you just how easy it is to set up. The other thing in the box is the remote control. So let's pull out the remote control, which we will talk about in a minute. And we're going to go ahead and set it up. So again, this is a, a standard off the shelf from Best Buy Samsung TV. And I'm just going to go ahead and plug it in. And the first thing you'll notice when you actually go to do this yourself, which I hope all of you will, is an industry first, only two cables, power over Ethernet and HDMI. So you plug them in, and then you mount it on the top of your TV. Hopefully you have a beautiful TV like this. OK, there we go. Now, I want to start with the beginning of a meeting. So let's actually turn the TV on. and. Uh, <clears throat> Pray to the demo gods with me for, for a minute, if you will. Make sure this all works. Uh, so we're going to get the TV turned on. Here we go. Hold on. TV, come to life, please. And the first thing I want to talk to you about is the remote control. There it is. OK, it's on. So the first thing that we um, wanted to address in this, and it had to be a great experience all the way through, the first thing we wanted to address is the remote control. I hate remote controls. I really dislike remote controls greatly. Unfortunately, you still need to have it as a backup. But we thought, hey, wouldn't it be cool if you could use the thing that sits in everybody's pocket? It's called a supercomputer. <laughs> and here it is. But we had to solve a big problem, right? Because we knew that the remote control is not a great experience. It isn't. And we wanted to have a great experience everywhere. Well, so we thought, OK, the remote control, is, it, the phone is great. It's a little supercomputer. We can use that. So how do we use it? Well, the first problem that we run into is, how do you connect the phone to the device? I don't know if you've tried this lately, but like, it's pretty hard to do. I mean, most of the products in the world, they're not that easy. Once you get them set up, yes. But we wanted to actually solve that problem, too. And so if I can get, you can see, this is, my, this is the phone here. And what we've done is we've downloaded an app called Proximity. What we wanted is an app that could be downloaded in any device, open the app, and then literally with no buttons, just by physically being near to this device, the application senses it and connects to it. That's what we wanted. That's the experience we wanted. So we had to invent and patent a brand new technology. Not Bluetooth, not Wi-Fi, something else. It's a secret. Let me show you how it works. <laughs> so you just pay attention to my phone now. And I'm going to open the app. So there it is, proximity. Searching for devices. There it is. It's found the device, and it's connected. That was it. So now I have a remote control for my do-it-yourself telepresence in my hand. So what can I do with this? handy remote control, a whole bunch of things. Come to my breakout, and I'll show you a whole bunch of other cool things. But one thing you can do is you can call people. Well, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I want to be able to call people. So I'm going to call Courtney. She's our demo person. I could just type in her name. 
She's on the other end, and she's in San Jose. So now we have some Wi-Fi. Oh, there it is. Hi, Courtney. Hi, Rowan. So proud of you. You did it all by yourself. And I didn't realize you were such a DIY artist. Thank you. Yeah. Um, so first of all, I just have to say, uh, Courtney, you look great. Uh, you're, well, say hello to everybody here in Las Vegas. Hello, Las Vegas. Hi, partners. Hi, Courtney. So, um, so you're coming into us from San Jose, and I know you have one of these on the other end. And I think the people in the audience can see the incredible quality and just how long it took me to establish that call. I mean, I was doing a lot of talking, but it takes a few minutes out of the box to make a call with this product. And that product costs less than this TV that you could buy at Best Buy. So that's really a revolution in telepresence, wouldn't you say, Courtney? I would. That is revolutionary. That deserves an applause. Now, Courtney was involved in the development of this product. One of the things that she uh, noticed as she was actually setting the product up, Courtney, why don't you tell them about the, the flip problem that you saw, and then I'll show them how we solved it. Okay, absolutely. So I think from a partner's perspective, we've all have been asked by customers um, for kind of some innovative things and solutions to problems they're trying to solve. Um, they want to put it on a robot? Okay. Uh, they want to mount it upside down? Okay, let's enable the technology to uh, allow our partners and customers to be innovative. So, so let, me, let me recap. What, what we're saying is sometimes what we found is people said, well, I don't want to do this because, you know, that's not a bad idea. That's not a good idea. What, what Courtney told me is they saw people were taking it. Hold on a sec. There we go. And they were just setting it down on the desk. <clears throat> the problem is sometimes people didn't read the Cisco logo, and they set it down upside down. So if you get a tight end shot, you can see, well, no, you can't see it. There's a Cisco logo. And we figured, well, people are just going to set it that way if they put it on the desk, and that will be fine. But what we found is people didn't really look at our logo, and they just set it down however they thought that it was appropriate. And so take a look at the screen, and you want to see the attention to detail. When you flip it around, it flips the image. So you can't go wrong with this product. So I have to say your pink hair looks fantastic on this amazing Samsung screen. Thank you. Can't wait to see you. That's another DIY. There you go. Hey, Courtney, this is an awesome experience. We're really excited. Thanks a lot for joining us today. Not at all. Great job. Bye bye. Later. Bye. And I'm going to end the call on my phone.